Hey guys, here's my outfit of the day. I'm wearing this flowy um, button down shirt with a white bodysuit, some long tan flowy pants, and some tan flip flops, and gold earrings, and my hair's in a ponytail. Here's the view outside the our hotel window. It's a beautiful lake. And I'm also bringing this bag that I got from the family reunion. Ain't no family the one I got. And inside I just have a big sun hat and a water bottle. So let's go. Okay, so right now I'm at the lake. There's the bus stop is here and I'm waiting to go take the bus, so I'm gonna go get some, I'm gonna start my day off with getting some soul food. And then we're gonna explore and walk around in downtown. It was barely anyone on there. It was clean. The driver was nice. There was no crazy people. Yeah, and now I'm in the train station, which is confusing. But I got my ticket. Now I'm just trying to figure out where to go. Oh, Broad Street Line. Got it. train wasn't bad either it was clean too as well so I recommend the bus and the train honestly it was reliable and it got me to downtown so I liked it now I'm walking like five minutes why am I out of breath <laughs> those stairs there's literally like barely any stairs and that made me out of breath while wow, I'm so out of shape <sighs> anyway walking five minutes to the soul food restaurant Hopefully it's worth it. It's giving East Coast vibes because it is the East Coast. Here it is, so Boat. Okay, so I stopped at this little shopping mall so that I can use the restroom and eat in the, in the AC. So I'm in the food court and I'm about to eat my food. So when I went into the soul food place, the people there were Asian. Which that's fine, but like it's a soul food restaurant. So you expect black people. What do Asian people know? But I looked at the food, I took a peek at the food, and it looks good and has excellent reviews. So let's give it a try. Okay, so this is how the food looks. It looks like legit. Oh, they gave me so much food. This looks like legit soul food. I got fried catfish, mac and cheese, cabbage. The cornbread is moist. They gave me the hot sauce. So maybe they have some black people cooking in the back. I don't know. And then it came in this like nice cloth bag. Thank you for shopping here. So I'm excited to try this. Nice little eating area. It's pretty empty and it's Saturday, but nice little food court area. So that's soul food. Baby. <laughs> Baby. I don't even know how to do that. Baby. It was good. <laughs> it was so good. It had like, everything was seasoned, flavorful, huge portions. It was just, honestly, that was the best soul food I've had in years. Like, highly satisfied highly recommend and it was only 15 dollars it was good so glad i went there i still have some leftovers because i couldn't finish it all so good so good now we're gonna go to 
City Hall and Love Park because Philadelphia is the city of brotherly love, if you didn't know. I don't know why it's so like empty. Like in the mall it was empty, outside it's empty. It's literally Saturday. Maybe because I'm used to, maybe because I'm used to LA and it's always crowded, but I love that it's like so empty. Let me, like look, it literally looks dead. No one, like barely anyone on the streets on a Saturday at 7 p.m. <laughs> In the middle of downtown. So here is Love Park and here it is. Everyone, look, even the line to take a photo is short. Love. It's literally behind me, you can see it, love. Okay, so Philadelphia in the summer, something that's really popular is to get, they call it water ice or water ice, but with their accent, water ice. And um, I wanted to get it. I haven't had it in like literally like 10 years because I used to visit my grandpa, me and my cousin would visit my grandpa in Philadelphia every summer and it was awesome and we would get the water ice, but we would go to like the, like the local places where they would like make it like homemade like fresh but there's none of those places around so I think I'm gonna go walk to Rita's ice Rita's Italian ice so it's not water ice it's Italian ice but I googled it and it said Italian ice and water ice are basically like the same so I'm gonna go get some cuz it's still pretty hot it's like 85 degrees or something so I'm gonna get some Italian ice I've never tried Italian ice but it's popular so yeah it's a 10 minute walk so let's go look what i found here's the clothes clothespin sculpture a huge clothespin random <laughs> here's the place here's my water ice or it's italian ice but it looks yeah just like the water ice I remember. I got the banana flavor because I love banana flavored everything. Mm. It's good. Refreshing. Sweet. It's literally like the perfect summer. Why do I look so sweaty? It's literally because it's 85 degrees out. It's literally like the perfect summer treat. This was $5 for the small. Back at the hotel. What a good day for today. Wearing my family reunion shirt, bag, black joggers, and flip-flops because I'm also leaving today my flights today so I want to be comfy but cute but yeah here's our food I got salted caramel banana french toast delicious and she got the vegan tofu scramble with potatoes with onions and peppers avocado and toast they give huge portions. Yum. And she got a matcha latte. Yum, yum, yum.